Hey guys, this is Candy in the land of sushi and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be reviewing and sharing to you my thoughts about the Anessa Perfect UV Sun Care Milk. Just a little bit of history, I have already tried this one on my first year here in Japan and I bought the 20 ml version of this one. This is the much bigger version which is 60 ml. There are two sizes. 20 ml and 60 ml. Now the reason why I stopped using this is because it is expensive compared to the Biore sunscreens that I use. You can buy this at any drugstores here in Japan. At Don Quixote, it costs around 2,400 yen for 60 ml. While this one I bought from Amazon two days ago and it cost me 2,700 yen which is 300 yen more expensive than when you buy this one from Don Quixote. I was really expecting this to be cheaper online because everything's cheaper online these days, right? If you're from the Philippines, you can buy this from Beauty Manila. I believe it costs 1,500 for 20 ml. You can also probably get this in Lazada and Shopee. I'll just leave the links down below so that you'll know where to get them. And I think they're also in Watson's Philippines. So anyway, this is a new version. The old version I used before doesn't have this, this blue cap. Before it was all gold. I think that's how you know if the one you bought is the newer version because the newer version has better formula compared to the old version. So I have used this product on my first year here in Japan but I stopped using it because it was too expensive for me. I think the 20 mils version is around 1,500 yen or it could be more than that. Yeah, for, for a sunscreen, it was just too much for me and I'm already content with my Beore sunscreen. I remember liking this one. I liked the consistency, I liked the formula and it did not give me breakouts. Now the reason why I bought this is because I wanted to try it again and I wanted to try the new formula. It promises a better formula and a stronger UV protection. That's why I decided to get this. So let's talk about its features. The new formula, again with this blue cap, provides the strongest UV protection veil that becomes stronger with sweat, water, or heat. This Anessa sunscreen has SPF 50 plus plus PA plus 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 plus. Damning plus. This is also paraben and alcohol free, which is perfect for sensitive skin. And this product is not only good for sensitive skin, guys, but you guys with dry to normal to oily to combination skin, you can give this a try. So far from all the reviews that I've read online, this product is perfect for all skin types. This UV milk sunscreen sits smoothly onto your skin and it's a perfect makeup base. You can use this for your face or for your entire body. This sunscreen contains 50% of its ingredients dedicated for skincare. So this is not just your usual sunscreen that protects you from UV rays or whatnot. This sunscreen also acts as your skincare, like your moisturizer and your makeup primer. This UV milk has an airy touch and it promises not to leave any white cast. We'll know later when we test this product. And it gives a pleasant and non-sticky feel on the face. It is developed with Thermo Booster technology, Aqua Booster EX technology, and it is super waterproof. It has around 80 minutes of super waterproof function, which means that you can use this when you're outside on the beach reapply this one every after 80 minutes or less than that if you want the thermo booster technology and the aqua booster technology only means that this sunscreen becomes stronger when they are exposed to heat and water the unique powder ingredients of this product allows the fingers to slide smoothly preventing the UV veil protection from coming off easily this has dual beauty ingredients which protects and hydrates the skin it has two key ingredients for moisturizing and conditioning your skin. The first one is the yellow flower extract and the second one is the green tea leaf extract. And the last point is that this is sand resistant. So if ever you go to the beach or go anywhere that has sand, you won't have to worry. The formula of this product prevents sand from sticking on your entire body or on your face. Now I will show you a swatch of this product on the back of my hand to let you guys know and so that you can see the texture and the consistency of this product. So as you can see, it's very runny. It's almost like 
milk. It is not transparent, it is very opaque, and yes, it has fragrance. It doesn't have a strong scent like what most sunscreens have. So I'll spread this on the back of my hand so that you can see if it will have any white casts. There, no white casts, zero white casts, guys. And I noticed how moisturized my hand is after spreading the product. It's not zooming in. It's not zooming in though, yes, there you go. It really moisturized my hand up to my arm. It's not oily at all and it's very, very thin. It's very, very light. I don't feel I have something on my hand. And I remember when I used this before, it was very light. It's as if I didn't use any sunscreen because most sunscreens are heavy, but this isn't. No wonder, guys, why this has been well loved by Japanese and foreigners alike. This product has been the number one sunscreen in Japan for many, many years. This one is a perfect product if you are worried about white casts and if you want a moisturizer and a makeup primer and a sunscreen all-in-one product you guys should try this one so there you have it guys that's my review and those are my thoughts about this Anessa perfect UV sunscreen skincare milk I hope you enjoyed watching this video if you have any comments please leave them down below I'd like to know what your favorite Japanese sunscreen products are for more videos about Japan please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and please click that bell button so that you get notified whenever I upload a new video that's it you guys thank you so much again for watching and I'll see you in my next vlog. Goodbye!